And so going into the season, uh, I'll start with Nell and then Lauren. What was it like for you seeing the scripts for the new season and learning or, you know, seeing the character arcs where they're going with this new chapter? Um, it's always so exciting when we get our new scripts for our new seasons. I mean, all of us are playing the same guessing game that you guys are as to what the hell is going to happen. So it's definitely uh, it's definitely a, a feverish read as soon as they get sent over. And uh, for season three, we had so much time to plan because of the pandemic. And, you know, there was so much extra time for it to be written. So we had the 10 scripts ready to go and, and uh, we had them before we started shooting. So... Yeah, I mean, for me, whenever I get the episodes, I sort of read them all in one sitting until like 4 a.m. And then they become this kind of fever dream that I have to pick apart and sort of re-understand as we're shooting. Um, but yeah, it's just as exciting, I think, for us to to find out what's happening to our characters as, as it is for the fans of the show and people watching. And um, yeah, I just can't wait to get my hands on season four and see how the hell this thing's going to end. Oh, yeah, no, it's always exciting to find out what we're going to do. And I was struck by uh, a lot of the, you know, there's some really funny scenes and moments um, that I think the writers did a great job with that side of the show and that sort of the, the, the opposite of the, the grief and sorrow and horror. There's, there's some really very funny episodes and funny moments. So what would you say for each of you was was the biggest creative challenge for you going into this season in comparison to the the past ones? I think that my my characters changed so much since season one that this kind of new strength and this new edge to Leanne comes in season three and also paranoia plays such a big part in the first half of the season for my character that I had to sort of tap into that and really try and hone that emotion and 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 um try and execute that emotion with as much truth as i could um so that was creatively quite difficult for me there was a lot more physical challenges for me in season three as well i do a lot more stunts a lot more running a lot more screaming a lot more skulking around the house if that was even possible um but yeah i mean it's just stepping into this new version of Leanne, which is such a different one from the girl that we first met. So it's almost feels like I'm playing a different character because I sort of know how to do the original Leanne and this new Leanne, I was having to learn day by day and try and understand her. So that was actually a bit of a challenge for me, but it was a rewarding one. Well, I had, I spent a good amount of time on set with some very ornery babies. So uh, we know we have sets of twins that come in and play Jericho. And so I was, um, in addition to my acting duties, uh, you know, I'm, I'm a mama in real life, but this even pushed my, uh, skills to the brink. And, um, yeah, I, 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 it was a, it was lessons in, in patience and, uh, and, uh, you know, clandestine snack feeding, uh, between mm. lines, other people's lines sometimes to keep, to keep people happy and sated and quiet. So <laughs> it kept well, me in that's... the moment present. <laughs> Well, that's awesome. I, I think that's uh, that's that's quite the extra skill on top of having to, <laughs> to act in a scene. Uh, well, thank you both so much for taking the time to chat with me. I really do appreciate thank it. You. I've had a blast with this season so far, and I can't wait to finally get to get my hands on the rest of it. 